Hi, my name is Annabel Alarcon and I'm Transport and Datacom Product Specialist at Expo. I would like to welcome you to this Multilink Mentor. Expo Multilink is a complete testing management system that assists lab managers, engineers and technicians to have a more efficient lab environment. So what is Multilink? Expo Multilink is a unique lab test management system with multi-user interface that offers remote access to multiple models, multiple platforms across multiple locations. It is the only true web-based interface that enables this capability. Expo is the only one in the industry that offers this capability. Continuing with the Multilink overview, Expo Multilink simplifies testing, offering five very important features that enable it to be a very powerful tool. First, it's a web-based tool. Second, multi-user, multi-module, multi-chassis. Third, inventory management. Fourth, module management. And finally, software firmware management. And now we're going to go through the details of the key features from Multilink. To access to Expo Multilink, the only thing you have to do is in the address area, you have to introduce the IP address of your host server, then backslash, then the word Multilink, and then enter. After that, you're going to get this web page where you're going to introduce your username. This is the Expo Multilink interface. And right now we're going to talk about the more important parts of the interface. In here, you can determine specifically the ID of the user that is currently connected to the web interface in case of you connect with multiple users. The area where we see the chassis and the modules is called dashboard. And here we have a menu with all the actions that you can perform uh, with this uh, interface. If needed, the menu can be hided just to see the dashboard and be able to have more details on the chassis and the modules. In here, as you can see, we have a specific icon for the chassis. You can even determine how many modules it has connected and the contact person that you can call if you have any problems. Also, you have uh, here the verdict and the status of the last test that was run on that chassis. Also, you can uh, configure a tag for the chassis in case of this is your uh, host server and you need to identify it. Another part is the modules. Here we can see that the modules have different icons and you can also determine in which slot they are connected. In case you need to run a test, you can click on the launch module button and you're gonna be able to connect to the specific module you need. Now we're going to talk about the optical modules that are now supported in Multilink. As you can see right now, this LTVA that we are launching right now has two optical modules. As you can see, it's the same icon as a TND module. Just for us to see how the application works, we're going to launch the applications for this module. We go through the connection uh, process. And right now we can see uh, we have the application of that specific module. This one is a variable optical attenuator. And in here we have the level of attenuation we want to introduce to the link. And that uh, is the functionality of this module. Okay, now uh, we're going to the part of seeing a little demo of the Skippy commands. Right now, as we can see, we have uh, connected to Multilink host server. We have the prompt that says ready. In this moment, we have we are able to introduce all the Skippy commands we, we, we need. In this case, I already have uh, some lines prepared for the demo. So I just, uh, I'm just going to copy paste it. And that is how we were able to run the Skippy commands.